Hey everybody, thanks for joining. If you're new here, my name is Eva, and today I'm gonna to talk about some fun summer bags. So let's get started. When I think of summer bags, I think of this kind of material. Well, actually, <laughs> I don't know what this material is, and, and so I think it's straw. It's straw or wicker, and that's one of the first things I guess that we need to figure out. Like, what's the difference between straw, wicker, and sometimes I see the word raffia thrown around. So let's clarify that. Okay, so from my quick research here, I've learned that straw is made from a dry stalk of grain plants, such as rice, rye, corn, oats, or barley. And products made from straw are quite firm and inflexible. Raffia is a natural material coming from the leaves of palm trees, and the material is known to be quite malleable and flexible. And the most interesting thing that I learned is that wicker is not necessarily a material, but rather a method of weaving the products. So now I understand that you could have a product that's called wicker, and it could actually make, be made out of straw or raffia. This is a Francis Valentine bag. Of course, as you can see here, it's trimmed in my favorite color, fuchsia. And it's got this really fun black and white lining on it. This is also one of my very favorite summer bags. This is the Loewe bag. I think this might be raffia, but I'm not 100% sure because I did buy it secondhand. I love the colors on this bag. They go all the way around. The colors just make me so, so happy. This is a coach bag. It's a big basket bag trimmed in black. I have the scarf tied around it so that when I do have my things in it, I can just, you know, kind of cover them up a little bit. But it has this old school signature pink print on the interior of it. These are just some of my favorite summer bags here that I've laid out just to kind of give us inspiration. So then I'm going to just show you some of the bags that have caught my eye. So sit back, relax. Let's just go shopping from the comfort of our own home. Maybe that will just help save you a few bucks if you're not actually in the stores. Or maybe you'll be inspired to go online after the video. If so, I can't be to blame for that. <laughs> Regardless, I just hope you have fun of looking at all the different options of bags that are out there this summer in these different materials. I had a lot of fun looking at that. I hope you do too. Okay, let's get going. Okay, I'm starting with Furla. If you've seen some of my previous videos before, you know that I have this 1927, but I don't have it in this wicker. I love this so much. I love both this uh, dark brown tan color and the black trim as well. Probably the only reason I don't have it is because it's not on sale yet. I also really liked this uh, Mimi bag from Furla. I like the combination of the raffia and the black leather and also the elements of the stud detail. I'm also including these bags by Furla. The description said that they were raffia, but that they were paper raffia and that caught my eye. Here are a few bags by Kate Spade. This first one reminds me a little bit of that Dior bag, you know, that has the the oblique material that cinches up on the inside, just a little bit anyway. And look at this super cute top handle. I love that. And speaking of top handle, look at this lemon wedge bag top handle. Here's some navy and white or creamy white totes. And I like these coral colored emphasis on these. And here's a cool bucket and very cool beaded effect. Now my very favorite from the Kate Spade outlet is the first one. Look at this watermelon. <laughs> it is so, so fun. I love it. And here's some novelty, the heart and the crab. And then here are some floral embroidered totes. And then the super cute top handle with a ladybug. Tory Burch has all kinds of raffia and straw bags to look at. Here are some Ella totes in both the small and regular sizes. And then there's a Perry tote as well to look at. And then here are these like rectangular Ella totes as well. And I have the McGraw tote and I've done a review on that. I really love it. And I love like this fishnet design here, very nautical. This is a raffia camera bag. And here is a raffia Kira camera bag and a Kira flat bag. Two unique designs, the canteen bag and the mushroom bag. And here you have two bucket bags and raffia with black trim. Here are two flat bags. One is soft, we know that from the title, and one we can assume that is very rigid, it even looks rigid from the photo in the Eleanor style. And this is so fun and unique, the Wicker Fisherman Creel Bag. <laughs> I love it. 
Okay, let's move on to coach. Now the first one, when I pulled the photo, I saw that it says it's almost gone, so it may be gone already by now. I know it's very popular. The Rogue 20 in Wicker. And here's the soft tabby in the multicolor straw. And Coach also has these totes in straw as well. And so many fun, fun things at the Coach outlet. This was by far my favorite from the outlet. This is the K Vanity case. It is so, so cute. I love both colors and I'm telling myself I love it, but I don't need it. And these are cute in both colors, the little Nolita 15. And here's a great bucket bag, both colors. And these are so pretty with the embroidery. And these are so cute. I don't know which color I like better, the blue or the orange. And I love this combination of the straw and the leather together. Again, here, it's on the tote as well. And here's this embroidery again. You see what I mean? The outlet has all of these options. And you have this flap and the classic tote. Okay, since I started the video with showing you a Francis Valentine bag, then I thought it would be appropriate to wrap up the video with showing you more Francis Valentine bags. I think their bags are so charming. So this is some of their current offerings. And as you can see, they have many to choose from that are straw and raffia. And what can I say? I just think they're very enduring. Let me know in the comments below which was your favorite from this video today, or let me know in the comments below if you already have a straw raffia bag in your collection. I'd love to hear from you. So thanks so much for watching. You take care, and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks. Bye.